From the last trip, I still have this wonderful box in here. And we try to, we like to continue now with this project, putting the box on the ground. We try to get a very low angle from the animal. Um. Where's the white angle lens? <laughs> Give it to me. Hang on. Thank you. Push the button. It takes a picture. And yeah, just closing it. Well. And then, zack. What is the optimal, what is the best distance? Yeah, three meter is too long, two meter. One meter, two meters, but yeah, two meters. Two meters is perfect, one meter is also good. Last time I, I I made a mistake because it was all all has to go very quickly because we saw the line is on one on one driving track where the car's driving and then the sun was was backlight and uh, yeah okay I'm happy let's test this thing again. Just need some time. Yeah, they're still running away at the moment. No, they're just looking at me. <laughs> no luck with the hyenas. So we're looking for something else. I'm just walking here and we just try to put my magic box in their way. This is taking the bean back. Maybe he's a vegetarian. <laughs> Likes to go home. There she goes with the bean back. I mean, I did this a couple of times and they sometimes just take, take the box or just play with the box. Uh, they already took yeah. the sand back. So we had to arrange something with stones. Um, Another line is no, on my box. I'm not triggering now. The line almost kicked the box again. 
to the side, but luckily she didn't. And now a big lion is coming. <laughs> challenging, it's difficult. I mean, they didn't walk in the second line like I positioned the camera. Settings are still good. It's not that the light not didn't go too bright. position was perfect, but I'm not sure if I have the right picture, but uh, I will check this later in the lodge, because now we are still... Watch more behind the scenes videos from Klaus Tietke's upcoming documentary film, Safari of My Life. Subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so as not to miss the next video.